In this video, we're going to take a look at the best way to install a Xerox print driver on a Windows 11 desktop. Go to your printers menu in Windows system settings. Click add device. You will see a list of devices pop up, but I recommend choose the printer that I want, want isn't listed and add manually. Choose add a local printer with manual settings. Create a new port, standard TCP IP, and enter the IP address of the copier that you are trying to print to. When you get to this screen, install the printer driver, click Have Disk, and browse to the folder where you downloaded the Xerox driver from the Xerox.com website. You can use the global driver as I'm doing here, or you can use a model-specific driver. Click Next. Replace the current driver if you already have one. Give this printer a name. This is the name that will appear in your list of printers and click next. After the installation is done, you'll go to printing properties to set the printing defaults. This process can take a few minutes, especially if it's a new printer on this desktop. Click Next. It's up to you whether you want this to be your default printer or not, and click Finish. Choose the new printer in your list of printers, and go to Printer Properties. Click on Advanced, Printing Defaults, and choose your Printing Default Settings. I recommend black and white being on and one-sided print. Click Apply. If you are updating a print driver, you may also want to go to General and Printing Preferences and make sure that your defaults have taken effect. If you're using accounting on your system, you may need to go to this menu and set the accounting defaults that you prefer.